want to do something with me tomorrow? Uh, I don't know. I was kind of hoping we could spend some time together. I don't know. I'm pretty busy. Come on, Allison. I'll borrow my friend's sports car. We can cruise around. Anyone ever tell you you have pretty eyes? Come on, what do you say? Uh, all right, what time? No, no, Allison. You're supposed to say no. That's the whole point of this exercise. Well, it's hard to tell a guy that you don't want to go out with him. Maybe Allison felt like being nice to the poor guy for a change. Maybe she felt romantic. <laughs> we all saw what just happened between Sam and Allison. But come on, guys. What was supposed to happen? Sam was supposed to come on to her, and she was supposed to say no. Only she didn't. I tried, but he had some good lines. Yeah, but Allison, that's not the point. Well, he wouldn't have taken you were, no. You were supposed to look him straight in the eye and say no. Well, he wouldn't have taken no. Some guys just don't hear the word no. Like at parties, guys are coming on strong all the time. Half of them think you're there just to be picked up. Aren't you? No. I'm there to have fun. Look, it's simple. Either you want to or you don't. I've got the right to make up my own mind about how far I want to go without some guy thinking I'm a tease or a bitch. No guy's gonna feel okay forcing the situation. Who cares what anyone thinks? Maybe you don't care, but some girls sure do. Okay. So what needs to happen if both people are gonna feel okay about themselves? Sex. Oh. Oh, is that all it's about? Just sex? Good point, Allison. Anyone want to respond? Sure feels like that. Guys want more than just sex from a girl. Well, speak for yourself there, buddy. Everyone's got an act. Some guys, you just have to be macho. And girls, some girls think they have to play hard to get. It's the same old story. It's one set of rules for the guys and another set for the girls. But who made those rules? Those rules are all around us. Guys are pressured to be strong, powerful, dominating. Well, girls are expected to be emotional, sensitive, passive. But then we all get trapped. Exactly, Allison. And that's what this class is all about. Breaking out of those traps by challenging those so-called rules. Hey, one workshop won't solve all your problems, so please take care. Have a good weekend. If anybody wants to talk about this further, stop by my office anytime. God, I felt so stupid today. Yeah, I know, me too. So y'all set for Jenna's party? Oh, yeah. Okay, great. Um, I'll see you outside. I Paul's got his car. Okay. Allison. So what's happening with you, Allison? Lust? Which leads to... Dancing? <laughs> Give me a break. So I gave my boyfriend a friendly little kiss. Oh, pretty friendly. Did you see the look on Sam's face? You better watch yourself, Allison. I can handle Sam. It's not Sam we're worried about. <laughs> see you Sunday. See ya. Allison, if you come by my house around 4 o'clock, we can get dressed together. What do you think, Sam? Should I wear the uh, green or the blue? Oh, the green. Definitely the green. <laughs> you guys, it's not every day I turn 18. Well, do you want me to bring something? Oh, no. Don't worry. Everything's arranged. Uh, Jenna's not really the uh, chip and dip kind of girl. <laughs> Sam, do you want to come in? I should get home. Anyways, your mom's probably making dinner. Well, my mom's not going to be home for another hour, and my dad's the cook. Gee, when you put it that way. Later, ma'am. See ya. Thanks for the ride. Bye. Oh, I'm really looking forward to this party. What are you wearing? Well, Jenna's got some clothes she wants me to try, but... Yeah, I don't know. Way better, don't you think? Um, I don't know. It's not really me. Try these on. See, guys like a girl with a little bit of mystery keeps them guessing. Oh, come on, Jenna. It's the 20th century. No, really? Well, when did that happen? 
I must have been doing my nails or something. You know what I mean. You have to be cagey with guys. Well, what about honesty? Oh, absolutely. I mean, if you don't like the guy, don't lead him on. But I know you like Sam. Oh, are you kidding? What do you mean? Half the girls in grade 12 are ticked off at the fact that he got nabbed by a grade 11 girl. He could have any girl he wanted. Except me, of course. I really like him. That's honest. Oh my god, it's six o'clock! We're never gonna make it! How about Dad's tux? <sighs> yeah, very funny, Jack. Just relax, be yourself. Or something comfortable. You know, my sweatpants are comfortable. Wear that. She'll love it. Thanks. You want my socks? No, uh, I was wondering if you have any, uh... Any what, Sam? You know. Yeah? <laughs> Protection. For me? No, no, no. I'm spending the night with my law books. <laughs> no, Jack, for me, seriously. Come on. I didn't know you were that involved with this girl. Well, we're not. Not yet, but... Well, you gotta be a Boy Scout, right? be prepared. Yeah. Didn't you get her anything? Oh yeah. I gave her a present last night. He touched her. Hi. You look great. Thank you, City. Really great. You smell great. Sam! Jenna! What are you drinking? What do you have? Oh, come. Hey, the Billmeister's here. Let the party begin. Oh, Carol, she's such a flirt. Did you see games Saturday? No, no, I was. doing it. I hate these earrings. Aren't they gross? Why did I wear them? So, Allison, Sam seems to be very interested in you tonight. He's such a cute guy. Mm-hmm. Lucky Allison. Where'd you go to? I was in the bathroom. I missed you. Oh. Um, do you want to get another beer? Oh, no. Why? No, I don't know. Do you want to dance? Okay. Sam. Sam, are 
mesmo. Do nada. Isso é a minha pior semente. Okay, now I'm really stupid. Good. <laughs> uh, do you want to get some food or something? No. Where are we going? You'll see. What are we doing here? I... I want to be alone with you. Sam. Sam. Allison, don't you like me? I like you. I like you too. Do you like this? I like it, but... What are you doing? No, Don't worry. Okay? I won't let anything happen to you. I got protection. Protection? I thought you liked me, Allison. I do like you. Sam! Come on, relax. I'll hurt you? Don't! Please, you're hurting me! Allison! Sam, stop! No, you don't hurt you. <laughs> Allison! Is everything okay in here? Allison, I'm sorry! What the hell is going on, man? Hey! How was the party last night? Leave me alone, Jack. What's your problem? I don't want to talk about it. Well, I know you well enough to know when you're upset. I'm an idiot, okay? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, so big deal. So I really blew it last night. What do you mean? I really like Allison. I tried to have sex with her. She didn't want to. Well, that's happened to a few guys over the past 50,000 years. You don't get it, Jack. I tried to make her do it. Hey, Allison, shake it up. Go away. Hey, what's wrong? Nothing. What happened? Sam dump you? I don't want to talk about it. I should never have gone to that party with him. Allison, what happened? Oh, it can't be that bad. Oh, yeah? Well, it is, okay. I just tried to... Just... I should never have worn that stupid outfit. 
But who am I kidding? It's all my fault. It doesn't matter what you wear, Allison. Oh, yeah? Well, it made Sam a little too hot to handle. I thought she wanted to. I don't know. Maybe I just wanted her to want to. I didn't try to force her. You sure about that? We were just dancing and making out and stuff. It got kind of hot, so I took her to the bedroom. Did she want to go? She never said no. Did she say yes? Never asked her. Look, so I got a little heavy, okay? A little heavy? Is that how you want to remember it? You know what they call guys who get a little heavy with women? What are you getting at, Jack? I wasn't gonna rape her. Well, that's what the law calls it when a woman doesn't say yes. I thought she'd want to if I took the lead, right? That was on top of me. It was like he just lost his hearing or something. <laughs> Did you want to be there? No. No. Everything has got out of hand. Oh, come on. Sam's a big boy. He knows that no means no. Well, maybe I didn't say no strong enough. I should have said something. I'm so confused. Allison, it wasn't your fault. How come I feel so lousy? Caveman approach has had its day, Sammy. <laughs> Guys act like they're getting laid all the time. They're not. I should have talked to her. Yeah. I think it's too late. Go see her face to face. It's really the only way. You're gonna have to face him sooner or later. I think I should go for a walk. I just need to clear my head. You want some company? No. I just need to be by myself for a while. Okay. Thanks, guys. Across the streets, you can get suspicious. I, I wanted to tell you, I'm sorry about last night. I'm really sorry, Allison. I was way out of line. Allison. I didn't really want to go into the bedroom. I didn't listen to you. I was wrong. You never even asked if I wanted to. Are you okay? Not really. Look, there's no way I can make what happened last night okay. I'm not at myself, too. You didn't do anything. 
I was putting on a bit of an act, trying to be like Jenna and all of her friends. There's nothing wrong with that. Yeah, I know. But hey, I can talk to you, you know. Should have been more clear about what I wanted or didn't want. I didn't have to wait till the last minute. It doesn't make any difference. Do you really mean that? Yeah, I do. I didn't have the right to decide for you. We don't really know each other all that well yet. It's not that I don't like you. It's just that I don't want to do it with some guy at a party. I really don't want you to hate me, Allison. I'm glad you came by. Tell you the truth, I wanted to call you too. I didn't want to have to wait until tomorrow at school. Can we go out again sometime? I don't know. Not for a while. I kind of need time to think about all of this. I'd like to be your friend. Well, we'll just wait a while. I'll give you a call.